I'm Patrick Garreau, president of Catholic Charities. Today, I'm at the Bishop Cosgrove Center, where over 250 meals will be served to the poor and homeless. We'll be speaking with Eric Milkey, director of the Cosgrove Center, shortly. Anybody want to say anything? Hi. Hi. Yeah. You're working hard. Working hard. All right. Working hard. All right. Costco Center. Working for the people. Costco Center. Yeah. Serving food with love. All right. That's right. Say that again. Serving food with love. Lots of love. You want to say anything about what you're doing? What? You want to talk about what you're doing at all? Oh, we're packing bags for our food pantry distribution. Our guests will come through and they'll pick things off the shelves, but with uh, trying to limit the uh, or create social distancing, we're bagging things that we just distribute them to them when they come. Thank you. We have a farmer in the Pittsburgh area who's donated 400 gallons of milk. And here's the leadership of Catholic Charities and others taking the milk off the truck. And the milk will be delivered to 12 different sites and locations within Catholic Charities. Eric, can you tell us how things are at the Cosgrove Center under these circumstances with the COVID-19 virus? With what's going on now, uh, things have obviously changed. We are um, down to our staff members with a, a couple select volunteers that we're able to have, but um, for the most part, we don't have the corporate groups um, coming in to support or, or any of the schools or anything like that, so it's all hands on deck. And we are just serving um, breakfast and lunch out the back door um, for the social distancing and to make sure that we still have staff uh, to be able to serve the people. And um, we're also doing our food pantry out the back door as well. So folks have not received their um, unemployment checks, they haven't received their stimulus checks, and they're um, without any income. So they obviously need to feed themselves and feed their families. And um, so we've seen an uptick uh, in our emergency food pantry bags about four times over. Um, what we normally see in a given month. Um, so we really need our uh, support from the community and, and um, our donors and funders uh, all coming together and, and helping us out through this. And um, we appreciate everything everyone does for us and um, everyone hopefully staying safe and staying healthy. So thank you. Thank you. We're gonna just take a look at the line. We'll get an idea of what kind of food is being served. There are fajitas today and chicken all made from scratch. 